Well, Joaquin is a hurricane, became one earlier this morning. We've got Air Force reconnaissance planes uh, continuously giving us data from inside the hurricane this morning. And we're going to be throwing a lot more aircraft resources at this problem over the next few days because it still is not certain whether or not Joaquin will directly impact the U.S. East Coast or we'll stay out to sea. We're forecasting Joaquin to become a major hurricane within the next three days offshore of the southeastern and mid-Atlantic of the United States. We already have a hurricane warning in effect for the central Bahamas and a hurricane watch for the northwestern Bahamas excluding Andros Island. Those watches and warnings of course issued by the government of the Bahamas because of Joaquin's very close proximity and slow southwestward motion toward the Bahamas. Now one thing we're going to do uh, this afternoon and this evening to try to get those models into better agreement is to send out the NOAA G4 jet and that will provide data for the computer models. We will see that output overnight tonight. So with the 5 a.m. advisory having the benefit of those data, hopefully the models will be in better agreement